Hey guys, what's going on? Steel Nova here, and today we have another episode of the Black Ops 2 Class Prediction Series. And today's episode is actually going to be about what I think the best offensive classes are going to be in Black Ops 2. Uh, so these are going to be the classes with the highest kill streaks and uh, the best guns that people are probably going to be using. I chose three guns in particular, which I think are going to be the dominant guns in Black Ops 2. Uh, but of course, remember, this is a prediction video. I haven't played the game yet, but I will actually be playing it in a few days. I do get the game early. I can't tell you how I'm getting the game early yet, but I will be telling you guys in a few days. And uh, so right before we start off this video, we actually are going to be doing another giveaway. And uh, I'll be doing a few giveaways in the following videos just to like, you know, get ready for Black Ops 2 and just, you know, to appreciate you guys uh, watching my videos and liking them. I really do appreciate it. And I did just hit 30,000 subscribers. I might be doing... Uh, maybe a uh, gaming setup video like that uh, pretty soon uh, but we are doing a giveaway this video and if you guys want to win all you got to do is leave a like on this video and uh, maybe a comment yeah actually yeah you do have to leave a comment so I could find the winner and then lastly just make sure you're subscribed to my channel and uh, what I'll probably be giving away is something smaller I can't really give away another Black Ops 2 copy that's kind of expensive but I will be giving away more stuff like that soon but uh, for today's giveaway it's either gonna be a $20 PSN card or a 1600 Microsoft point card and if you are not on these consoles like uh, if you don't have the PlayStation or the Xbox then uh, I will also be giving away a $20 GameStop gift card if you are not on these consoles but uh, hopefully you are it's a lot easier for me but if you're not that's alright just leave a comment there's only gonna be one prize for this video uh, so one of you guys will win leave a comment telling me what console or system you're on if it's a PlayStation and Xbox or if it's on a different console so you'll win the GameStop gift card uh, so just do that right now also make sure you've liked and subscribed to my channel and you've liked this video but uh, yeah anyways let's jump into the topic of this video so I chose three different classes and uh, for all three classes I kept everything the same except the gun I changed the guns on all three classes uh, that doesn't mean I'm gonna be using the exact same three uh, setups besides the gun I'll probably switch it around of course uh, but for this video this these are the basically the best uh, setups besides the gun that I could find that would work best for getting high kill streaks and going on the offense and this is what I would probably be comfortable with uh, but this probably will change when Black Ops 2 comes out uh, so this first class is using the M8A1 with the secondary being the Cat 40 and uh, this is actually the pick 10 layout right here and uh, it's not as pretty as the past picture we had, so we'll change back. But I did use all 10 loadouts. So I chose the gun, the M8A1, because I, we saw a lot of that gun in the Gamescom gameplay. And it looked really good. David Vondahar actually said, quote, it's probably one of the best guns in the game. And uh, then I'm using the Cat 40 as my secondary because this is the only uh, automatic machine. It's like a machine gun pistol, kind of like the Glock from MW2. But it's a lot more accurate, kind of like the FMG9 from MW3 so these two guns are what I actually predicted before what I think are gonna be the best uh, primary and secondary for Black Ops 2 the M8A1 looks really good and then the the uh, attachment I chose is this little laser dot sight which basically is a perk on its own that little attachment is basically steady aim so it's kinda like I have five perks in this setup because for the perks I'm using the perk 1 greed so I get an extra perk 1 slot so I'm using hardline, flak jacket, scavenger, marathon we all know what these 4 perks are nothing really new here and then for the equipment I'm using the semtex and the shock charge uh, now the semtex is just basically because this is an offensive class I'm gonna be running around and uh, throwing the semtex just to get it out of my hands because there's really nothing else for the lethal that would fit in there and then for the tactical slot I'm using the shock charges because these are really cool new equipment and uh, basically what they do is when you throw them into the ground, whenever an enemy walks by them, they shoot up, stun the enemy, and it shows up as a hit marker for you. So that's good because you could just throw them on the ground around your position, and uh, whenever an enemy triggers it, you would know instantly where that enemy was, where you placed the shock charge. So that's a really cool piece of equipment I decided to slap on there. Now for the killstreaks, I chose the Orbital VSAT, the K9 unit, and the Swarm. And I uh, designed these classes similar to how people design Black Ops 1 classes, where people would use the Blackbird to help them get the chopper gunner and the uh, attack dogs. So the Orbital VSAT basically is the Blackbird. It shows their location. So I'm putting the, this killstreak on this class to help me get these higher killstreaks, which is the K9 unit and the Swarm. 
Uh, so everyone basically knows what the K9 unit. It's basically attack dogs. And then I'm also using the highest kill streak in the game, which is the swarm, which basically is a bunch of hunter killer drones in the air that goes around just hunting the enemy. So these are really cool three kill streaks that I think will be very widely used for Black Ops 2, which uh, most of the pro players will be using. And yeah, that's basically it for this class. And I did design two other classes, and I kept everything the same except the gun, uh, because I'm not really sure about everything else. And everything else which I chose, I think is going to be pretty solid for the best offensive classes uh, as for a prediction. So here's the second class I chose. The gun difference is the Scar H. And I chose the Scar H because if you've ever played MW3 and MW2, uh, the Scar was one of the best guns in the game. It was a close secondary to the ACR. Uh, so I think this gun is going to be pretty good in Black Ops 2 as well. And then finally, the last gun that I think is going to work out pretty well in the game is the Type 25. Because if you've ever used this gun in MW3, you would know it's overpowered. And uh, that was a huge issue with MW3. So hopefully this gun isn't as overpowered in Black Ops 2. Uh, but it probably will be a top used gun. That's just a prediction. But uh, yeah, I do think this gun is going to be pretty good. Uh, so that's it for this video. Hope you guys enjoyed. That is all for today. Make sure you have liked this video, commented, and subscribed to my channel to enter into the giveaway that I mentioned earlier. And that's it. Bye.